Tonight, a Muskegon County family is trying to make sense of what appears to be a horrible accident. 33 year old Brittany Bain was walking along US 31 last night when she was hit and killed. Her mother and Bain's fiance don't know why she was there. 13 on your side's Keely Lovern spoke with the family this afternoon and has their story. Norton Shores police say a woman was hit and killed while she was walking along US 31 near Sternberg Road around 930 Thursday evening. That woman has now been identified by family as 33 year old Brittany Bain. <laughs> police say this all started when they got a call for a woman who was walking in the road on US 31 near Sternberg Road Thursday night. Minutes later, an officer responded to reports of a car hitting a pedestrian on the highway. Little did they know David Dalton had been frantically searching for his fiance, Brittany, in and around the nearby mire. I'm freaking out walking through the store with my two kids and I get up to the front and I'm just trying to keep my cool. And I had them announce her name again and I called the police at the same time. Dalton says they had been out celebrating Brittany's son's seventh birthday before making a quick stop at the store. She decided to wait in the car because she wasn't feeling well. I was excited to be here with her and we spent a day together great day. Brittany was not in the car when David and the kids returned and it wasn't long until David heard the devastating news that a woman had been hit and killed nearby on the highway. He had to identify her by her tattoos. I didn't know what to do. I got my two kids sitting there and all I can think about is I'm trying to feel this but I'm also just trying to be there for them. So it, uh, we're just sitting in the front of Meyer on the floor. Dalton says the family and police are still trying to figure out why she was walking in the road in the first place. It don't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense why she was going to hide it. Dalton says Brittany never drank or did drugs. Social butterfly, she didn't need it. She just, uh, she'd have a good time without anything. She didn't need anything. And was always focused on her children. She just loves kids. She loves helping others. Now the people that love her the most want her to be remembered as the loving, funny, caring person that she was. She was a homebody that wanted to see the world. She always found her good. She always found her good, no matter what. She always found her good. Police are still investigating this incident, and they're asking anyone with any information to please contact them. You can also report anonymously through Silent Observer. Reporting in Norton Shores, Keely Lovern, 13 on your side.